Hi, I'm Junjun. Welcome to my channel. Look at what I made yesterday. The steamed buns without any yeast. The black spot is fermented black rice. And this is the rice cake. They both are delicious. Let me show you how I make them. Take a look. This is homemade fermented black rice. I'm gonna leave the link down below and you guys can check it out later. See how to make this fermented black rice. It is super easy. You just need to steam the black rice and then use the wine yeast. Ferment this black rice for a couple of days. This fermented black rice is extremely sweet. Technically, it's the process before the rice wine. Okay, I never done this before, but I always wondered if I can use fermented rice instead of yeast to make the bread, buns. So I'm going to try it today. Let's do it. To be honest, I don't know how much fermented black rice I'm supposed to put in there. So let's start a cup first. All purpose flour. I'm gonna start with two cups flour. This fermented black rice is naturally sweet, so I'm not gonna add any sugar in this dough today. Smell like yeast, like wine, that fermented smell. The dough looks kind of dry. I'm gonna add one fourth cup of the fermented black rice. The dough looks great. Now I'm gonna leave this in a bowl, cover this, let it rest for about one hour. All right, I have a little bit left in the jar. I'm going to use this to make a rice cake. I'm pretty sure the rice cake is gonna be good because it never required to rice the dough. If the fermented black rice can't work as a yeast, it will be fine. So I'm just gonna pour this in a bowl. I'm gonna use sweet rice flour. Add one cup first. The same here, I never used the fermented black rice to make the rice cake before. This is gonna be the first time I try with you guys. So I had four ounces fermented black rice and I add one cup sweet rice flour and the texture looks pretty good. I'm gonna cover this, let it rest for an hour or two. It has been an hour. Well, as you can see, they're definitely not double sized. This one has risen a little bit but the sweet rice flour one is not much. Anyway, I'm gonna steam both of them. Sticky. I think because the fermented black rice. The black rice is kind of like sweet rice. I have to use a little bit of flour. This is really interesting. I used all-purpose flour but the dough came out so sticky. I did put some cooking spray on the steamer rack. I'm gonna use this mold, put a little bit of flour inside, put this sweet rice dough inside of the mold. Use the high heat, steam them about 15 minutes. After steamed 15 minutes, I didn't open it and cover it for another 10 minutes. Actually not too bad after we steamed it. It has rising a little bit, but not really puffy or airy. Not hard either. I actually like it. The texture tastes like sourdough. The bunny rice cake. Oh, it is way chewier. You can't even break from the middle. Oh, wow. Let me taste this. This is very good. I love it. The texture is exactly like rice cake but the flavor is way different. You almost got this wine taste in the rice cake. I definitely will go for this one. Use the fermented black rice to make the rice cake. It is amazing. 